Okay, we're going to ignore the fact it's like practically summer out. It's like 86 degrees and I'm unboxing a knit sweater and sweatpants, but we will ignore that. We'll also ignore this is the second time of me filming this commentary because I deleted the other footage. First up from Essence, thanks to their flash sale, the Relax Sweatpants in the Dark Heather Oatmeal colorway in a size small. Now, as you can see, you have some of the actual Heather Oatmeal material or the fleece portion on the actual flock design of the 1977. No problem, just take a lint roller to that and now you have the high contrast of the flock 1977 on top of the Heather Oatmeal. If I'm not mistaken, the teased part three drop should have the smaller Fear of God Essentials logo present on the brand new relaxed sweat. So just stay tuned for that. But again, we have Essentials here, the tag, size small, and a pickup from Essence, which I really appreciate them only being $70 at the time and free shipping. And this is just a side-by-side -side of these with the traditional uh, tapered cuff sweatpants you'll get from Fear of God Essentials. This also in the dark heather oatmeal and to me one of the most unique items from the brand new spring summer 2022 drop the raw edge knit sweater you guys know these brand new knits they are amazingly comfortable i stand by that so for the flock design as you can see 1977 as well but it's also stitched around the perimeter now you have the raw edge around the neckline, but also it's unfinished at the bottom. So it will naturally roll up at the bottom hem as well as the sleeves. The extra extra small measures 21 inches across armpit to armpit and 25 inches down from the top of the shoulder to the bottom hem just for size reference. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see. Yeah. These days I don't worry about much I think we should have some more fun I still dream about the days when we were young I'll take the hit and TJ back another video on talks with TJ rounding out the spring summer 2022 collection pickups well at least for part one and part two because part three has been teased on Instagram already so I'm guessing more accessories different hats the bucket hat I know that's on a lot of people's radar uh, but then just some other things that we didn't actually get from part one or part two so as I always say hey just follow Jerry make sure you're following the essential page um also the fear of god leaks page that way you're up to date on information regarding drops news teasers all of that i don't know that i'm going for anything because i think the drop is going to come relatively fast maybe june maybe july so i don't know how many items i would get from that again there's a lot of life that goes on outside of sneakers outside of clothing and you just have to do or tackle whatever is on your plate at the moment so i don't know if i'm going for anything in drop three um i will still more than likely try to get a video out just showcasing what is uh what what's expected to be in the drop itself to be able to help you guys out and then of course good luck to anything you may go after but uh just for today's video listen went back for two items one again based on that sell via essence really really lucked up there and then the raw edge knit sweater now if you would still like this but maybe you need an extra small well mr porter has like the entire range of sizes still available so i would shop around and see if mr porter has what you need essence fearofgod.com itself um, i'm not sure if unknown got anything but that's always an option and then paxson which we all know how i typically feel about paxson but you know what maybe things are changing maybe things are changing with these drops sitting a little longer than usual which i fully appreciate i have no problem with that okay for people saying fear of god is dead awesome please go go on move on to something else that's not a TikTok craze and those who want the items can actually get the items so i'm not sure if that's part of it but listen uh this sweater was still available on paxon so it was an easy purchase uh no problems at all and it arrived to my doorstep in a very timely manner 
like really really fast so this experience was good with Paxson. maybe you guys are trying to turn my mind around a little bit when it comes to you for these essentials drops because it's been hell in the past at least not now so uh let's go ahead and look at a side by side of the brand new raw edge knit sweater next to the knit hoodie i picked up from this collection and then the sweatpants with just a simple side by side of the traditional sweats but then also how i choose to style the new knit I'll give my measurements. Hopefully this is a little bit helpful, but I'm 5'6", 127 pounds. In most Fear of God Essentials tops, I go with a small, which is exactly what I did for the brand new knit hoodie on the right in the wheat colorway, which was also part of the spring summer 2022 collection. Rule of thumb typically for Fear of God Essentials, get whatever normal size you would get in any other brand for the intended oversized look. If you want something more true to size, then go down a size, maybe even two sizes. For the raw edge knit, keep in mind the sleeves are not cuffed and they are pretty long, so the extra extra small fits perfectly. It allows for great layering underneath. As you can see with the Fear of God Essentials cream tank underneath the knit itself and i love the sleeves i love that it's unfinished i love how warm and soft it is just not in this really hot weather right now but it's an amazing piece i adore the neckline as well so the inspiration for the looks you guys are seeing really quick side by side for the sweatpants the model from the spring summer 2022 collection lookbook she's wearing an oxford shirt with the relaxed sweat so that's what i did here one of my favorite oxford striped shirts and in the middle the brand new fear of god essentials relaxed sweats in the dark heather oatmeal colorway on the right, I'm wearing the same colorway, Dark Heather Oatmeal, but instead in the core collection, traditional sweats that taper down to the ankle. Here's an actual look of the raw edge sweater style two different ways. One being with the six collection shorts on the left and the Yeezy Boost 700 V2 static. And on the right, wearing the new relaxed sweats, just so you get an idea of how they both look on together with the same 700 V2 static. With the raw edge sweater being cut a little higher than some other items may be, it allows for a great layering look. So if you have a tank or a t-shirt you would like to show underneath to add some contrast between whatever bottoms you're wearing and the sweater, go for it. The final look for the Fear of God Essentials Raw Edge Knit in the Heather Oatmeal colorway, wearing that with the same layered tank underneath, the Fear of God Essentials Strap Back Hat in the navy colorway, the Everyday Minimal Pants, uh, they actually have a draw cord on the bottom as you can see, in the olive colorway, and then finally the Fear of God California in the cement colorway. For me personally, the temperature outside needs to be 60 or below to truly enjoy wearing this knit without sweating profusely and overheating. I sacrificed and suffered a little to get this footage, but it's an amazing piece. I'm so glad to have. Thank you guys so much again for tuning into this video so comment your thoughts on the raw edge knit sweater do you prefer your sleeves to actually have cuffs would you like them to be unfinished does that matter to you uh please sound off when it comes to that i wasn't sold at first on the raw edge piece but after seeing it worn a couple of ways on instagram listen it's always instagram or pinterest that ends up influencing me uh i said you know what let me give this a try so i'm really glad i have it again i just personally would not rock this unless it's 60 degrees and lower or there's like a really strong breeze that's coming in it's just it's gonna be hot if it's any higher than that i think when filming the outdoor portion of this video it was like 65 and i felt it okay even in shade <laughs> i felt it and it immediately came off after the video but uh it's definitely a piece i will cherish for fall winter those cooler months or if we get some cooler nights we might have some nights where it's maybe like in the 50s or actually just hit 60 so i'll enjoy it then but nonetheless another item added to the collection two items actually added to the collection from the fear of god essential spring summer 2022 drop apparently part three is on the way so stay tuned for any news i may have on that as always act your age not your shoe size peace